So getting a little late start to this. It's about 5 a.m. I'm going to dry brine and work on seasoning and then hopefully get on the grill around 7.30 doing brisket kind of last minute. We'll see how it goes. So I did a about an hour, hour and 20 minutes salt dry brine. I know probably should be a little longer, but and then we're doing rub with bearded butcher black. I'm gonna let that sit for about an hour as well, and then I'm gonna work on getting the grill ready. Someone made a nest by my cooking supplies. Beautiful morning, getting the fire going. All right. We have got the rub on and it is brined and we are ready to go on the grill. We are at about 225-ish. Got a good bit of coals going. That should last us a while. I've got several more where that comes from. I'll put this on and add some apple wood as I don't have any mosquito hickory like I thought I did. So here we go. Mama Wren has arrived and she is not happy with the grill. So, grill's here, my shelf's here, and her nest is there. She gives me the evil eye whenever I look or try to adjust the temperature. Oh well. I relocated from where I usually sit down to the other end of the porch, leave her be. Four hours and 15 minutes into it, um, plateaued at around 155-ish, 153-ish internal temperature. So wrapped it in some foil to kind of help crutch along and put it back on the grill. We're doing pretty good. Grill internal temp is 230 with, looks like the meat's at 157. So probably a couple more hours and then it'll be time for deliciousness. In the meantime, I put up a trampoline for Russell. Well, Helen helped. Do you like it? Yeah, I do. Can you fall on your butt? Jump and fall on your butt. Yeah! That was fun. Do you want me to do fast? Yeah, do it fast. Russ, sit down. Do you agree on your trampoline? <laughs> Haven't been good with videoing this time, but grilling update. It was on the grill for a total of 11 hours. I have wrapped it in foil and it has been wrapped in several different towels and I now have it in the Yeti. We're gonna have it sit here for about an hour to two, let it kind of slowly cool down a little bit and then it'll be ready to eat. 
Right now I've got some whole potatoes on the grill. Uh, put a, a little bit more charcoal. I've got up to about 450 and are indirectly grilling the potatoes. Uh, I can't really see it in the GoPro, but I've got a couple of corn on the cobs in the foil as well. And those will go on in the last 10 to 15 minutes. Kind of closer to the fire, but still indirect. We'll see how it all turns out. Got a lot of brisket to eat. Made. Oh, I did it again, my Okay, we gotta go inside. Okay, let's go inside. Okay. Are you disappointed in this one too? I can tell the way you turned the first thing. Let me get to the middle, dear. It's pretty tender. Mommy. What, Russ? I want no macaroni. We're having brisket. No macaroni. pretty it is it does oh, you want brisket brisket yeah it'll be good i bet you'll like it or do you want macaroni uh, i want brisket you want brisket instead 